Hey, Nick, we're going full full burglar mode here today, right? Yeah. With the burglar hat. Um, but hey, man, nobody, I, I, I don't think anybody had you penciled in to win the title today. Uh, you did. I did. You and Coach <laughs> Cottrell did, right? Yeah. Uh, but you come in here, um, you're the four seed, mm -hmm. okay? Um, and just Russell, awesome matches, man. You were buzzsawing all day. It's a close match in the semi, overtime win, huge win. But you attack fall the guy um, and Klaus, the returning national qualifier, and then in the finals, you, you just you just went off, man. You were just you were a buzzsaw today. What was it like coming in here and being in the zone today? Uh, it just it, it felt good. I finally, yeah, taking care of business, finishing on top. Uh, got in the finals, lost to him in conference. Uh, he a beat you. Ago. Yeah, beat me. He caught me in a throw. Um, dug myself in a hole, couldn't get out of it. So um, it was. I like to see that matchup coming into it. Um, after the semis, I saw I had that that chance to kind of get that uh, even the score, get back on my side of it. Um, but no, it definitely felt good coming in here, taking care of business, and uh, just having fun with it. Did you lose to Ool that day in the duel that you lost to Miller? Uh, I did not wrestle him that day. Backup wrestled. Who did you beat the backup? So, no. So I didn't wrestle against. You did, okay, uh, your backup wrestle. Yeah, my backup wrestle. Got it. Okay. Because man, the season's so wild to watch it, oh, and yeah. like how you just talk about like you lose to the guy, and then today you beat him fourteen to four or whatever you beat him in the finals. It's it's crazy. It's such a roller coaster. Yeah. Uh, between here, you know, you guys wrestled lights out today. Um, Glenville was just was just on. Um, I, I don't know if you could have wrestled any better, right? Um, every guy in the finals could have won, but you know you didn't. But there's always you can always critique everything. Um, yeah, there's always different position situations you can always look back on and uh, say I could have done this and that differently um, obviously we can go back watch film critique um, get better for the future but it's uh, what's done is done I mean we're we're uh, moving on next next uh, next day next big thing so we're not uh, not too much nitpicked on today I'm gonna just say this. What did he do in the last two weeks to you guys to make you wrestle like you did yeah, today? He, uh, he said basically um, what I was saying, just going out there, having fun, um, stressing that uh, that's wins and loss aren't necessarily the end of the world. Uh, life's gonna go on. Life continues after wrestling. Uh, just go out, have fun. Don't too, put too much stress on uh, the wins and loss of the matches. Just uh, do what we've been trained to do. Go out there and uh, just uh, have fun with it and wrestle free. How many years left for you? Uh, I got everything, as far as I know. Not years. How many years of school do you have left? So I got, I think, like three years of school. You have three, but I'm fre I'm a redshirt freshman. You're a redshirt freshman. Yeah. So uh, you can wrestle I, uh, four more years. Yeah, but this is my first year wrestling in seven years. So, so what's your story? Why? Why? Yeah, so um, graduate how, how old are you? Twenty. I turned twenty six in a couple weeks. So, so you're so you're non traditional student. Essentially, uh, is what they call that. Yeah. So I uh, graduated high school in sixteen, and then went to VMI, uh, redshirted there, and then uh, left there, less than the Marine Corps, and uh, been doing that for a little bit over five years now. You're still a Marine. Yep. Yep. Still on the reserve side of it. Super so, five, right? Super five, brother. What are so, we? Hoorah! I don't know. What, what else yeah. am I supposed to say? Right? Is that right? Yeah, that's it, yeah. Army, I don't know. Ura, don't, yeah, Ura's, don't, don't double uh, Marine, and then, yeah, Army and Navy did the other stuff. But. So you're non-traditional, and you've got three more years left. Yeah. That's amazing, man. And you waited to let the best for last. Do you feel old? Do you feel like your uh, body feel old? There's some, sometimes I feel a little bit older, um, but, you know, just going in, doing rehab, and uh, just taking care of my body, doing a little bit extra stretching if I need it, just being smart with it. Uh, obviously, being older, I uh, have a little bit more – I'm supposed to have a little bit more wisdom, I guess. Uh, but, yeah, just being smart in, in uh, certain positions and um, in practice room and, and therapy and all that, just uh, yeah, doing what I can to make sure my age is as small of a factor as it can in the bad ways and uh, as big of a factor in the good ways. I love learning things. I'm, oh, yeah. I'm a teacher, and I love learning. <laughs> I learn more from the people I deal with. And So are you on the GI Bill? Do you have the I am. That's amazing. I love everything about this conversation. <laughs> I'm getting more and more excited the more we talk. I don't know if you can tell. I mean, you beat up on my nephew today, and I'm still all right with you. I mean, it's, it's pretty amazing, right? Oh, yeah, no, but you're serving our country, right? Yes, this sir. is incredible. It's what it's all about. Absolutely. It's like I, I'm, I'm seriously fired up. I'm getting excited <laughs> like, because um, I talk to kids. I teach career classes, mm -hmm. and this is like the type of stuff I talk about with kids. And, man, and, and you know, like, when did you figure out, like, I can get back into this? And, and what, what, what was the switch for you? I... I talked about it with my family ever since I left VMI. Um, I was yeah back in summer 2017. I, I was like, where can I kind of match up um, timeline wise with working in the military and uh, school and just trying to get back into it. And just cards never really lined back up um, until last fall, whenever um, 
you know, coach, coach hit me up and he, he said, asked me if I wanted to come wrestle for him. And it just happened to be the uh, kind of the perfect time and place where I was at in my life, where I was able to move back home. I was living down in Tennessee. Um, where are you from? I'm from Parkersburg. I was from Parkersburg. Did yeah. you go to South? I went to uh, PHS Northside. Okay. Big Reds, okay. yeah. Big, um, big Red. Big Reds. Okay. Yeah, so I was I was living down in Knoxville for the past year. Um, and, uh, this is yeah, amazing. Hit me up. And, a great uh, story. I said, I said, let's do it. I've been 26. Looking for it. Yeah, this is in amazing. a couple weeks. <laughs> That's awesome. <laughs> well, hey, you're going to be celebrating your birthday hopefully out and in the, uh, Kansas. Uh, the week after Nationals, I turn. is my birthday, the 25th. Perfect. All right. Congratulations on the title today. I got to give you some stickers. You got anything else for me? I, I think that's it. Congratulations. I will see you in Kansas. Yes, Thanks sir. for not totally ruining my day. <laughs> but I, I appreciate glad, you. And, and, and you bounced, you bounced, he bounced back. And, yeah, and yeah we, I'm glad we he ended up see a third. In Kansas. Yeah. So thanks for making us better. And uh, good luck to you guys and see you in Kansas. Thank you, sir.